All right, let's turn to Sasha now, who is in a really tight spot going into the weekend because she can completely blow up a wedding if she tells what she thinks is the truth. All right, Sasha, you're on the voice disguiser. What you got? Hey, so um, my good friend is getting married this weekend. Um, and I recently found out from another friend that the groom, her fiance, um, actually cheated on her during his bachelor weekend trip. Oops. So you did not see this. I, I didn't see it. I heard it from a friend. Um, I mean, so you they know, said that they. No, I wouldn't say anything. That's a that's a rumor. Yeah, that's a rumor. I mean, what you can't go to the bride the weekend of her wedding and just say, "Hey, there's a rumor going around." I. Am I wrong here? Just because somebody says something doesn't make it tr- doesn't make it true. Like this is a completely different call. If you know for sure, right? You have like, evidence. Yeah, right. Like what? What did your friend say about his infraction at the bachelor party? Um. Well, he said that they like went into another room together. That they, you know. Okay. I could so have gone he in was, there to watch the game. All right. So I. <laughs> Breathe a little bit breathe, together. Breathe, pray. Yep. Oh, uh-huh. Okay. Um, all right. So, Sasha, your friend is a guy, and he was at the bachelor party? Yeah. Okay. So, this isn't like a girlfriend hearing from another, hearing from another. So, he was there. He said the groom and this woman went into another room, but nobody mm-hmm. knows what happened behind closed doors. Yeah. I mean, they didn't, he didn't share any from, I mean, it was, it really feels like it happened. I don't know. Like, I'm just torn because... You know, is this something that happens at bachelor parties? Like, do guys usually cheat? Is this like a one-time thing? And it's a new trend. You know, of, it's common. Uh, I don't uh, even need to worry about it. It's a new trend. Uh, it is. It's Bible study now, <laughs> mostly, is what I'm hearing, <laughs> which is probably what was going on. Nothing to be alarmed about. <laughs> Nothing to see here. Uh-huh. <laughs> I have a question. Who who was the one? Was she hired? Was the woman? Yeah. Why? Who is part this? of the bachelor party? Good question. Who was the chick that was at the bachelor party? Yeah, they had like met some. You know, they had been out and yeah. like met some, you know, women that came uh, back. Mm-hmm. And that happened at my husband's bachelor par- bachelor party. They were out in Nashville and they met some girls and they came back to the apartment for the guys that were single. Okay. And Bart took one of these girls into a room also? Yes, and then he puked into the side table. <laughs> <laughs> so these, these girls they met, though, they were just regular girls. Yes. They weren't like... Hired. No, yeah. they're not exotic dancers. They were not there for the strippy strip. I still think, look, you got nothing but rumors here. Do you yeah. plant this seed potentially on a bride getting married this weekend when there is zero evidence and all you got are rumors? So maybe dude goes into the room there because he's feeling pressured to impress the other dudes or whatever and nothing happens. Or maybe this doesn't even play out at all. Who knows? Yeah. Um, if anything, it's not your responsibility to tell whoever saw it. Mm-hmm. It's on them, and it's kind of unfair for him to tell you. And then, did he what? What reasoning did he have for telling you? Did he expect you to run to the bride and tell her? No, we're just really good friends. We yeah. tell each other like a lot of stuff, and like mm-hmm. he was like, "I don't know, you know, I, I think this happened," and like, "I don't know. I wish I didn't know." Of course, obviously. yeah. Like, isn't this supposed to be like bro code or something? You like stay at the bachelor party and you do your thing. But mm-hmm. at the same time, if that's what happened and this is who this guy is, like, I just. Uh, how how close are you to the bride? Like, is this your best friend? Um, we're good friends. Like, we've been, you know, friends since college. And, um, you know, I'm not like. <laughs> Look, I mean, this is... we're good friends. I don't want to. Are you, you in know, the wedding? She should know the information if it's if it happened. Like I feel, I would just feel bad. I, I, I feel like you're creating a lot of drama where where drama doesn't need to be. She's probably super stressed out this week anyway, as any bride is. And now you're one day before the wedding, so she's pinging with stress. And then you're going to go to her on, with a rumor. I I, I just feel well, like. What if it's true? Like uh, you could say that about any rumor. Yeah, right? well, wait, it's okay. certainly not going to be rectified in the next 24 hours. So Maybe. here's how it goes down. She goes to the bride. Bride freaks out. Okay. Goes to the groom. Groom says, I don't even know what happened. Don't go to the bride. Go to the groom. That's what I'm thinking. That's and what ju- I was about to go say. Go to the groom and, and tell him what you've heard and just look at his face, look in his eyes, see what his reaction is. That I mean, that's... If you have to do... If you feel compelled to do anything... That's what I would do. I would confront the groom. He's going to lie to you. Right. He's not going to tell you. Yeah. What's going to come of it? It doesn't make any sense. 
Okay. I would only say something if it was my like absolute best friend in the world. And Other then, than that, I'm not saying anything. And that means you're like the maid of honor of the wedding. Right. All right. So with that, don't take our advice. Go ahead. Go to either the groom or the bride. Create all the tension and then call us on Monday and tell us how it went. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. okay. All right. Sorry, Sasha. I just think there are people that like like drama. Oh, yeah. She's Absolutely. just creating that drama, man. Our show's based on it. <laughs> Thank God. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not judging you. I'm endorsing it. The Burt Show.